Now, let's take a look at an event next week that could well give us some trading volatility. Uh, this has in the past uh, been driven by us as a, a risk event. But we're talking now about trading volatility. And I don't want to highlight just one particular event because I think Wednesday could bring a couple of interesting uh, opportunities here uh, to trade the euro dollar. First of all is the uh, FOMC minutes I really want to focus on because this will describe the sentiment from the last Federal Reserve meeting uh, where they left interest rates on hold. And the suggestion was that there may not be any move uh, until, well, certainly not until they start cutting rates. In other words, the flatlining at recent highs. We've seen uh, evidence recently suggesting uh, that the Fed could actually uh, end up cutting interest rates uh, by May next year. But that has been blown away. Now, that uh, saw a big rise in the euro, a loss in the US dollar. Uh, since then, we've seen a slight reversal for that strength of the dollar uh, as people want to sort of take a check on all this. Uh, also on Wednesday next week, we get flash eurozone consumer confidence. Now, the way to trade this, let's take a look uh, in more detail about what we're expected to see. If we do see a continuation of this uh, a dovish uh, Fed, we could well end up seeing some further highs uh, for the euro dollar. Now, if you are uh, long on this, uh, going into the numbers next week, then you would look here to put your stop underneath this area down here at around about the 107.30 level. 108.30 is where we are. Uh, price target is up here at 109.45. Uh, my idea is, is that we've got this rising line of support, these higher um, lows that we've seen uh, as a continuation. And we've got the higher highs. Uh, and uh, this is uh, just a question of a retracement in what is uh, otherwise uh, a market which continues uh, to move up. So that's the idea for this. Uh, and you put your stop at around about, as I say, around the 107.30 uh, level. Uh, to give you some protection in case there is a continuation uh, of this market and it takes you out. Uh, but I think longer term, if we do get further evidence uh, that the eurozone uh, is uh, looking as though it's more likely to raise interest rates than the Fed, I think we could well end up getting further highs uh, for the euro against the US dollar. So price target 109.45. We're trading here at 108.37. Your stop is at 107.30. 